Nam the Kanu was the one who instructed IPOP members to attack okay. police and burn police station. Deji Adenyonju claims. An activist, David G. Adenyonju, has accused the leader of the proscribed indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, Mazi Namdekanu, of fueling attack against policemen and their station. Adenyonju made the allegation on his social media handles on Sunday. Daily Post recalls that men of the Nigerian police force were killed as many stations were burnt and arms scattered away during the NSAS protest. According to Adenyonju, Kanu had told his supporters to attack the police and that he also asked them to burn down the station. This Adenyonju ascribed as the reason he would not defend the leader of the Biafran agitators. Adenyonju opined that non-violent resistance would always work, saying, however, that the police should put an end to extrajudicial killings. Namde Kanu told his supporters to attack the police and burn down police station. That's the person you expect me to defend. Not violent resistance always work. However, the security agents must stop extrajudicial killings of those alleged to have committed any crime. If anyone has committed any crime, arrest and charge them to court. Stop killing Nigerians in revenge mission, he said. The Jardin has as has been a noise a noisemaker and he has not been making any point but most especially um anytime he he tries to uh, make complaints on any issue i'm not trying to say this because i'm supporting ipop i am not you just listen to what he has, what he has just said now nam the canon was the one meaning that he has concluded and meaning that he's claiming now that he was he was uh he was there seeing the IPOP members he was there seeing the IPOP members burn the police station meaning that he saw them attacking the policemen that is what he's trying to claim that is what he's, what he's trying to say that what he's trying to say hmm? so what is he trying to instigate insinuate now my viewers you can see that IPOP has has actually is now an enemy to so many nigerians so you can see i hope that has always been in the forefront protecting and speaking on behalf of many nigerians most especially in this period of of NSAS protests i hope that has always been in the forefront standing beside supporting nigerians do you can you count how many times mazinam kanu has run to the icc just because of the insecurity issue in nigeria can you count it when it is the issue of ipop you will see many accusing finger pointed at at, at ipop you can see many mouths and many many eyes on ipop you see that but when it comes to issue of the full enhancement oh sorry they would say they don't even know if anything of such is happening you understand that's what they will say so i am not surprised mr mr adinyoju is saying something of this kind it's it's a normal thing it's not the first person that is criticizing iPod. Many people have criticized iPod, but they failed. They failed. So if he is one of them and is believing to succeed, so sorry. So sorry, there is no way he's going to succeed. Because he's going to fail like his fellow brothers, his fellow lawyers. They are going, he's going to fail. He's going to be disappointed like seriously i bet you it will not succeed they tried it they failed how much more you understand so 
I'm just laughing because he doesn't know what he's doubling into. He doesn't know the, 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 the crime is committing by criticizing an armless group. A group that knows nothing about about the, the, the massacre in Onyubu. You see, so my viewers, what I will just say is this. IPOP should just be focused and not be distracted. Because now that many allegations are coming their way, they will feel intimidated and and and, and, and start feeling war and start being worried. There is nothing to be worried about concerning this. No one need to be worried at all. Everyone need to be focused. Everyone need to be to be to be to, to be to be to be focused and remain absolute. There should be no shaking in any way, because it's a normal thing. Things of this kind are bound to happen. But when it happens, your ability to face it squarely and defeat it is what makes you a group. So IPOP has faced so many so many um, situations of this kind, so many temptations, so many trials of this kind, and they, they defeated. Can you remember the the, 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 the attack at Emigu, whereby the DSS attacked the IPOP members, killed 28 members, with, uh, uh, arrested 48 members? After they did all of that, what happened? Didn't IPOP members go after their members and got them released? Didn't they? No, they still try to see how they can rubbish the name of Mazina Bikano in UK. Mm -hmm. But before they know it, UK came up and said that and defended Mazina Bikano, saying that he knows nothing about what they are trying to say to the, about the allegation they, they are about to levy on Mazina Bikano. You see that? Listen to Adenyoju talk. You can see this is a pure blasphemer. A pure blasphemer. In fact, we have many of them in Nigeria. They should keep talking. That will not prevent Biafran from achieving their goal. The goal of Biafran is freedom. And that they will achieve. No man born of woman will stop them. That is why they are putting up all these things. So my viewers i plead to us to please remain focused and undistracted because they are out there to distract you all right so uh, my viewers deem it fit to leave your comments below the comment box click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to get updated whenever we upload any new videos thank you